Wonderful people, viewers and subscribers, you're welcome back again on this platform where we tell you undiluted truth and also bringing you contents that is in line with our commitment on this platform. And what is that our commitment? Good governance. You heard me say that my own kind of politics and campaign is for all the politicians converting for your vote. Let them campaign with what they have done to you or for you or what you have benefited from them not hand out to not philanthropism somebody will come and share about rice he say you have done something for you no that is rubbish somebody will come and share um kekena pep for you or select some few people and give them a kada and when they go into into office they will ban those things that is not uh, the kind of uh, good governance we are talking about. We are talking about establishing institutions that will affect the lives of the ordinary people directly. Talking about education, health, infrastructural development, human capital development. All of these things. I am bringing Senator Ekunife. There is an old video I've made about her. I made it last year actually where she went she organized what they call um what they call innovators and they, i'll bring that video later on okay but this time she established a hospital the ultra modern hospital and maternity located within the saint john's catholic parish neni an ultra local government area of anambra state is built to provide access to quality and affordable health care services for the people of Nini and its environs. At the official handover of the facility, built and equipped with modern health facilities, the senator representing Anambra Central Senatorial District, Uche Kunife, said the hospital will help address the issues of access to quality health care facing the community and the people of our North local government area. Whatever we can do to better the lives of the people, irrespective of our political or professional calling, the bottom line of every service is service to humanity, especially to the downtrodden. This edifice is being called primary health care center. Primary health care center means giving basic, basic administration of primary health so that when it gets to a position where the primary health cannot contain it anymore, you have history of medical records. Some stakeholders from the community as well as Anambra Central appreciated Senator Uche Kunife for erecting the facility in the area and for her quality representation. This is the basics, this is the best, this is the most important that because this hospital now can uh, save thousands of lives. We are talking about partnering with ourselves, everybody, so that this will, will last. So my senator, my distinguished, thank you so much. Very happy. You know that health is wealth. And this one is at the grassroots. The senator is more greasy to her elbows. Madam Senator, I want to thank you for this initiative. You love your people. You know what your people need. And you are doing it. Keep it up. Our senator, we are good senator. That has uh, that been doing marvelously well. We see her projects. So I think um, we can all attest to this. Earlier in the Holy Mass to bless the project, Bishop of Oka Diocese, Most Reverend Paulinus Ezor Kafo, extolled Senator Uche Kunife's representation and prayed for God to continue to direct her. We know the student senator has been doing this type of thing all over her area, and that is something wonderful. And we appeal to her to continue to do so, and also because this is what we call dividend of democracy. The St. John's Hospital and Maternity in Neni is one of the numerous projects attracted by Senator Uche Kunife for the people in Anambra Central Senatorial District. You see, I appreciate her. I applaud her. She's not the only one in contest so, for Anambra Central Senatorial Zone. The same is also applicable to those contesting in other zones and other states. Campaign with what you have achieved for the people. That is my own stand. And I've been saying it. Thank God. Emo Kemavia, Mwike of River State, have redefined it. What buying here is giving me project. Do you understand me? What buying here is what give me project. 
give me good uh, governance, give me security, pay pensioners, pay gratuities. The way you do that, come and take our vote. I'm like, and that is where I stand. Um, other contestants contending to or canvassing for your votes, let them, let them canvass for your votes from what they have achieved. Not that the person gave you money or he paid your children's school fees because you have one direct personal interest. No, I'm talking about public interest. Something that you, you alone is not the beneficiary. It is for the public. Congratulations to Ndimkwele and the Ndiyaru who promises fail, as you can see today being the 31st of uh, December 2022, uh, which Fair has fulfilled his promises of keeping this road. Well, which Ekwunifei is more, I want to choose that, he from St. Thomas, in the Zanya, I forgot to know that, I don't know. Obi White, the DJ. Yeah, if you want to cook, I'm here. Well, uh, I, I don't know you now. Hey. I don't know you. So that's how you start the first school school to be done. Yeah, I'm going to go. 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 <laughs> oh, <laughs> like him, also loser. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. 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 These are the kind of things that I will expect you to look out for before you cast your vote for anybody. Don't waste that vote. That is just why I'm bringing this video to you. So, all other candidates, I'm still searching and looking for what you have done so that I will bring it to the viewership of our people. Because when they start competing with the achievement they have made that is directly beneficial to the general public, not to selected few, you will see the public will start smiling and having or feeling the impact of good governance. And that is my commitment, and that is my vision. That is what is driving me in what I am doing. I want to give kudos to Ive Koledo. You have really made your constituents proud. And others who are doing the same, bring it forward, though. Our numbers are there. Though. We are not only showing failed governance. We want to see good governance in practice. Bring it forward, and the world will see. That is the only kind of campaign. That is the only kind of um, canvassing for votes. I will like our people, Nigerians generally, to engage in. That is the only time you will know that good governance is possible. Let them compete with the achievement and not with the word of mouth because we have been deceived enough. I'm signing out. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Drop your comments. I want to have your opinion on this. And share this video subscribe please if you have not we'll continue delivering this message to you bye bye for now